So today I'm doing a somewhat DIY doggy door build. So this is the doggy door that we bought, a large, so the dogs can go in and out on their own, on their own. This is the door that I'm gonna convert myself. So I'm gonna knock out these four glass panels so that we can put the door here. As you can see, if you can see that, we're gonna put the door here so the dogs can go in and out. Most doors, most doors come with something like this. So you can cut around and attach stuff. If you cut like that or something, you can attach the doggy door to it. I looked on YouTube for some videos and no one had this door. Okay. Okay, so this is my stencil that I have to use to cut out. I've already cut out one side and I'm gonna go cut the other, but these are the instructions and I'll show you the outside. <laughs> Mommy has her kom kombucha back here. These are her little hotels. No, one hotel, all of this kombucha. One hotel, all kombuchas. Yes. That's her hotel right there. No, this is the pot, this is That's the, the hotel. That's the pot, That's the hotel. Obviously, I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> so it's a little chilly out. Okay, so I've already cut out one door. This one is gonna go to the outside. I've already framed it out or kind of marked it out, if you can see with that pencil. And then I'm gonna put this template on here. I'm gonna trace around and I'm gonna cut it out and it's gonna look just like that. So one will go to the inside of the house and one to the outside. I started seeing black particles come up and I was like, oh my gosh, I was cutting my stool. I'm gonna tell you right now, there's nothing worse than starting a project and your tools aren't charged up. Drives me crazy. So here we go. This is what it looks like. So this isn't secured in here or anything like that, but that's the hole. This is one of the flaps. And so we got like a double flap. It's gonna go on both sides. So it fits around this little edge. You see that? So that's gonna fit into that little cubby, like so. So there's two of them, one for the outside and one for the inside. So like I said, we got double flaps. So I didn't see any videos online of how to change a whatever type of door this is with all this glass um, on how to make a doggy door using that. So I'm making a video, hopefully this will help someone else. And it's getting dark, so We'll come back tomorrow and knock the rest of this out. All right, so I'm getting ready to pop these four glasses out and see what happens. I have the first part of this put up. So, can't wait to do the outer 
piece. And I think this is the piece that goes in right here like this. Oh, please don't fall. Well, it won't stay up there because, let me see if I can lean this piece of wood up against it. All right, so that's kind of how it's gonna look. We're gonna have to paint that and give it a little more decorative look, but pretty cool. So I gotta do the outside because we have a double flap. So yeah, there you go. Tomorrow. So that's it with it in there so far. That's looking good, but I had to take a break because daddy needs some food. And wifey got us some soup that she made from scratch. <laughs> probably caught this also all the way around and then uh then that'll be done we'll paint it and do whatever paint it probably white to match the door and then like i said we'll finish this out in here with some decorative pieces and fill that hole in thank you and mama's over here making some kind of shrimp thing egg. some pasta egg, egg rolls and we did this darn doggy door Honey, give me some dance moves. Oh, ah, oh, ah, 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 oh, ah. <laughs>